All right, welcome to the next unboxing, guys. Here we have an electric blue Jack Dempsey. Best footage. There he is. Alright, up next we've got a lot of German Blue Rams. I think there's like 15, 20 in here. Come check those out. Alright, here are some electric Blue Rams. Haven't had them for a minute, finally got a bunch in. Lost the cheese from them. Alright, here we got some really large orange volcano snails. Or, I'm sorry, orange rabbit snails. Alright, here's uh, an exciting one. Here's an extra large. L128 Green Phantom Pleco. I'm sorry, Blue Phantom Pleco. L128 Blue Phantom Pleco. Extra large, big one. Oh man, he's like at least six, seven, almost seven inches, six inches. I don't know. It's huge. Alright, here we've got another extra large L128 Blue Phantom Pleco. These guys are from the Ornaco. Beautiful spots on them. Blue Phantom Pleco. Um, they're carnivorous and so they need, you know frozen foods and stuff like that. Not just a pleco that eats just algae. It won't survive. Gorgeous addition to a tank though. You can put them along with discus or most community tanks. They like to be between 78 to 82 temp. Probably worth mentioning. It's a gorgeous pleco. What a beast. All right, here's another stunning Pleco. This is a Hyphen L200 Green Phantom Pleco, an extra large size too. Gorgeous Pleco, come check it out. Perfect for 75 gallon, they reach about seven inches max. Gorgeous Pleco. And this is the Hyphen version. It's not just your L200, it's a Hyphen. All right, here's a rare community fish. Most probably haven't heard of. These are called gorgeous fish, by the way. These are the mustache danios. Larger size danio. Beautiful colors on them. Yeah, really happy with those. Alright, here's a unique uh, oddball catfish that I've never heard of or never seen. Um, this is the clown catfish. It's Gagata senia. They're from India and they grow to be six inches in size. Kind of, kind of like your clown loach, but it's a clown catfish. That's what they're called. Pretty unique. Come check them out. Got about three of them. Alright, here. 
customer request. Some really nice red devil angel fish. Some nice Dalmatian self and mollies here. Great size, nice and healthy looking. And some combo tetras. a quarry I haven't seen yet. Um, these are the quarry reticulatus, also called the reticulated quarries. Good sized. Sorted mystery snails. I see some iris, some blues, some browns, some magentas. Some neon tetris. Here's some red eye, liar tail, sword tails, hyphen. Some more neon tetras. Some lemon tetras. I had a few born here at the shop and there was only a couple that survived so I got a little bit more to make a nice little group of six for someone. I like them. Yellow tip tetras or lemon tetras. Alright, here's one I've been waiting to get back and this these guys are really nice size, healthy looking. Excited about these. These are the whiptail catfish. Royal Farawella. Really good size. Come check those guys out. Alright, here we've got a customer request. I usually don't do the whole balloon, but here are the electric blue balloon rams. Pretty rare to find those, but I got them in for you. Got some uh, sorted female fancy guppies. Looks like they're all nice and pregnant. Alright, we got some rummy nose tetras. Nice looking black sailfin mollies. That's look good. Good sorted extra large guppies, fancy guppy males. Stir by Corey's. Some more Ruminos Tetras. Here's the Gold Rams. These 
guys are great sized, beautiful, lots of males and females. Come check them out. Alright, here we have a ton of ghost shrimp. Lots and lots of ghost shrimp feeders. And we got a ton of plants. It's just a giant Santa bag full of potted plants. Last but not least, we got some beautiful large blue pinoy angelfish. There in the background, it's a Christmas tree, and those are double long fin green dragon bristlenose plecos that were born here in the shop from our breeding pair. Um, there's also a real super red cherry shrimp in the background in there. And uh, if you're seeing something squiggly at the bottom and wondering what that is, those are live black worms. They are not available yet. I'm trying to culture them enough to make them available. Um, but yeah, thank you guys. I always appreciate you and always looking forward to seeing you on the next one.